Hey, what's up Capricorn? I'm Infinite Star Heart. Welcome to my channel. This would be your August 2020 monthly reading for all of my Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Alright, if you have those placements anywhere in your chart, these messages may resonate for you. If you're new, welcome and thank you for being here. If you haven't already done so, go ahead and subscribe if you would like to stay updated with the current energies and the content on my channel. Okay, I can also be reached for a personal reading. You can email me at infinitestarheart at gmail.com. Okay, check the description box below for more details on that as well. Alright Capricorn, we are officially in Leo season. So let's see what are the messages you need to know for the month ahead. All right, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Let's see what are the messages you need to know for the month of August. Please note this is a general reading. Only apply the messages that resonate and leave the rest. All right, Capricorn. <coughs> Let's see what are the messages you need to know for the month ahead. All right. Several cards flying out here. Your first card is travel, movement, meeting, adventure. Be ready for new experiences. All right. Nice. Beautiful. So lots of traveling going on. <coughs> you have separation, no contact. 5D, dreams, nightmares, focus on your own happiness, okay? Um, Alright, you could be separated from someone during this time. This can be your soulmate. You have that here. Compatibility, companionship, your best life partner. Okay. <clears throat> Let's get some more cards out here. And then I'll let you know what I see for you. Okay, you have balance. Yin and yang, darkness and light. Stay centered, stay centered in your higher self. Okay, beautiful. <clears throat> what else for my Capricorns? Hidden path. Detour, slow down, explore, go in a new direction, okay? Masculine, your divine masculine, your twin or soulmate seeking you. Any more for my Capricorn? That is way too many. I'll take this one. Um, you have destruction, tower moment, unexpected change, new opportunities. Okay. And at the bottom of the deck, you do have regret, remorse, life regrets, and loss. Start making empowered choices here. Okay. All right, Capricorn. Um, what I'm getting for you for the month is that um, definitely there can be lots of travel going on, okay? Um, be ready for new experiences, all right? You did have um, the hidden path as well that talks about you traveling. Um, there could be some detours, you know, along the way. Along the way. Um, that's just, you know, life itself, right? Okay? Um, you have separation here. I feel like you um, currently could be separated from uh, someone that you were dealing with here. Alright, this can be, um, you know, a friend of any sort too. Um, but <clears throat> right now what it's, Spirit is saying is that you need to focus on your own happiness, okay? Um, you possibly could um, have seen this person in your dreams as well, okay? If you're separated from them. Um, <clears throat> this person possibly could be missing you. Alright. Okay, this is your soulmate. 
Some of you could have a new soulmate that's coming in for you for the month. Someone who's going to be um, more compa compatible to you, alright? This is going to be um, your life partner, someone that you can grow and build with, okay? Um, usually, um, anything other than that, like a twin flame or a karmic partner, they're just going to mirror things back to us that we need to work on within ourselves, okay? They're mostly about lessons, all right? Soulmates are going to help you grow, you know, if there are any lessons that are still needing um, to be learned. Um, it's going to be for, you know, your your highest good, okay? It's going to help you grow, and you're going to be able to grow together. And it's going to be balance here, okay? This is... Um, you having um, someone that's going to reciprocate, you know, the same, that whatever you're giving, they're going to um, give it back in return, you know, um, they're going to match your energy as well, okay, they're going to be a, um, you know, a good match for you, you have hidden path, um, slow down, explore, go in a new direction, okay, so I feel like um, some of you could be taking a new path, going on a new path uh, this month, okay? Um, this could have to do with you traveling as well. Some of you are going to uh, some new places that you haven't been before, all right, possibly as well. Um, some of you could be, you know, going overseas. Um, this, some of you could be taking a cruise. I see lots of water here, um, lots of body of water um, during this month, okay? You could be by... Um, some lakes, you know, doing that sort of thing as well, just being out in nature, um, you know, hiking and things of that sort. I see a lot of, you know, mountains and things in the background as well, okay? You also have destruction, okay? Tower moments, unexpected change, new opportunities. Um, I feel like this is a tower moment you possibly um, are not expecting, okay, the, this could be a sudden change, but this is going to be a change for the better, okay, when a, um, when destruction comes in, when a terror comes in, it comes because, um, there is needing to be some changes, some shifts, you know, that need to occur in your life, all right, so, um, do not be feeling regretful, you know, during this time, I feel like, um, you know, over a loss, you know, some of you could be missing someone from the past as well, all right, um, some, uh, you have potential here, it's in the reverse, okay, um, I feel like maybe if you were wondering if this person, you know, was any good for you, and maybe you thought that they had potential, and I don't feel that they do, okay, um, this person that you're dealing with, that they possibly could regret, you know, the loss of this connection as well, okay, but I don't see, you know, there being any potential of, um, this connection going anywhere, okay, I'm going to pull a love oracle for you, get some more messages for you, for you to love open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all yes um beautiful i feel like this is for those of you that have a new soulmate that a new soulmate that is coming in for you this month all right it is safe for you to love i feel like this connection is going to be very balanced for you okay Some of you could be meeting this person while traveling, alright, romantic feelings, your feelings are real and worth exploring, okay, um, you are lovable, you know, during this time, Capricorn, so I would say pay attention, um, there could be a new romantic interest that stir up your feelings this month, okay, um, pay attention to the signs as well, alright, I feel like, um, someone new that that's coming in you know you're feeling like this is your soulmate if you're wondering this is confirmation for you okay 
finances and career financial issues are a factor in your love life right now okay some of you could just um, possibly just be focusing on work you know you could be traveling um, for work and everything as well but and possibly been wondering you know um, if you're going to meet anybody due to you always working okay um, I feel like you will meet this person while you're out um, like I said, it could be for um, work. You could be traveling and running to someone um, at a new, you know, at a new place. You know, this can be a new, um, you know, town, somewhere new that you're visiting. Okay. Anything else? You have heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other, okay? And at the bottom of the deck you have trust. This situation is calling for you to have trust, okay? Um, I feel like this is the energy surrounding, you know, how you felt um, in this connection. Maybe there was some trust issues as well, okay? Um, finances could have been a factor for some of you here um, with heart to heart conversations I felt like um, you all were in a space where you had to honestly and openly you know um, let this person know like what you wanted as well um, possibly just wanting to be able to uh, travel during this time some of you could be going um, could be going far taking a, a job that's going to be, you know, uh, long distance, okay? But definitely lots, lots of traveling going on for you during this month. I'm going to pull a Souls Oracle for you. Any other messages? You have the seven of Gabriel. Stand up for what you believe in. Have confidence. Claim your personal power. So yes, uh, the seven of Gabriel is like the seven of wands in the original tarot. Okay, um, you could have been dealing with someone that has fire in a chart as well. Okay, but this is you standing up again for what you believe in. All right, knowing that. Um, you know, you having the confidence as well, um, knowing what you deserve during this time, okay? You possibly had to uh, defend your beliefs, and that's what you had to um, speak openly about to your uh, partner or whoever this was that you were dealing with as far as what you wanted in this connection. You have the two of Gabriel. Make bold and ambitious ambitious choices. Great progress is possible. Important relationships with people who share your vision. Yes, absolutely. Um, the two of Gabriel is like the two of wands. Okay, this is you possibly, um, you know, was being at a crossroads, you know, um, not knowing which direction to take. Okay, but with the, this two of Gabriel coming out here, um, this is on top of your romantic feelings and, um, the soulmate and with the balance card. And I feel like, um, you're going to be meeting, like I said, new people that are going to be, um, balanced. They're going to match, um, your energy, um, as well. Okay. Um, important relationship here. Okay. As this is your soulmate that I feel is coming in for you. All right, you have the four of Ariel. When you give, you also receive. Being resistant to change, extremes in how you save or spend money. Okay, um, I feel like this is you needing to let go of control, okay? Um, also, this is you having a balance and, and give and take here, all right? Um, some of you may need to pay attention to your spending this month as well. All right, but nothing um, to really worry or, um, you know, focus too much on, okay? 
right? I feel like some of you um, may have been feeling, you know, this resistance to uh, change as far as, um, you know, letting go a connection here, okay? All right, let's get one more. You have the three of Michael. Release the past. You will grow from this situation. Time heals all wounds. Absolutely, Capricorn. Okay, this is the energy um, I feel that you're needing to step in during this time, okay? Um, because, yeah, you you and this person, you know, um, you know, there could have been a betrayal here. All right, you all have uh, already separated, gone your separate ways, gone your separate ways here, but there's no need to be holding on, um, where was that, yeah, the regret card. There's no need to be holding on to what was and what didn't work in this connection here, uh, Capricorn, okay? Um, this is you still holding on to, you know, feeling like, um, you know, this person really betrayed you. You you possibly could be having a hard time getting over that. But again, like I said, it's okay. Um, now we're let, we're letting this go. That way we can have an open heart and go towards our new uh, soulmate here. All right. It is safe for you to love during this time now. So you're needing to have trust that um, this person that's coming in is going to, you know, be good for you. They're not going to be like what you had dealt with here in the past, okay? At the bottom of the deck, you have peace. Release the past. There is a more enriching future coming. Let go and let God. How many times do we have to say it, Capricorn, okay? Um, Spirit is saying all over this reading that you're needing to let go of the past, okay? You're needing to heal from this. Let it go. You know, don't dwell if you were, you know, um, conflicted in any kind of way regarding um, possibly going back. Um, you know, it's, it's your choice, but again, I feel like in order to move forward um, and learn the lessons that's needed here in order for you to grow and um, receive the type of connection that you so deserve, okay, a balance relationship okay a connection that's going to be you know healthy for you that's not going to have you second guessing you know um just your worth and um anything else here okay all right financial and material changes okay this is what i felt um could have been unexpected to you or someone else that you're dealing with okay we have the destruction card all right again this is coming in um unexpectedly for some of you um there could be some changes in your uh financial situation this month as well okay let's get a few more you have passion ignited and accelerated motion beautiful okay um passion ignited this is you having a new start at something okay it's something new that you could be working on this is having creative energy as well okay this can be a new romantic interest as we've seen earlier you have a new soulmate that's coming in um this is something you possibly you know work wasn't expecting, you know, um, during this time, possibly wasn't even thinking someone was going to come possibly so suddenly here. You have a cel acceleration, um, accelerated motion, okay? This is things moving and happening quickly for you, okay? There could be, um, some of you could be re relocating, uh, this month as well, okay? Um, like I said earlier, also lots of, uh, travel, going on at the bottom of the deck you have movement choices and decisions again yeah so a lot of you are going to be in this energy um you're going to be doing a lot of movement some of you are moving 
um, different locations. Some of you are going to be traveling this month, okay? Um, seem like it's going to be a busy month for you um, as well. All right. Um, I don't, some of you, um, like I said, pay attention to your uh, spending this month as well. I'm going to clarify some of these energies. Okay. Why is separation? Yeah, you have the two of cups in the root. Um, you have the two of cups. All right. You could have been dealing with someone that has... Gemini in their chart, okay, you have the Ace of Cups, alright, you have the Two of Swords, in the reverse, and the King of Pentacles, in the reverse, so, um, what I'm getting here, Capricorn, is that you possibly felt like this was the one, okay, um, to only find out later that, uh, this person, um, wasn't ready for, you know, a commitment, okay? They could have, um, you could have looked at them as a manipulator here, all right? They possibly didn't know what they wanted here as well, okay? Leaving you in mental conflict about this, uh, connection, all right? What else here for my Capricorn? Okay, you have the Nine of Cups here coming out on top of your soulmate, alright, this is a wish fulfillment, a wish coming true, okay, this is, um, you being happy with a new person that's coming in, alright, you have the four of wands and the four of pentacles, alright, this is, um, unexpected change as well, um, this can be a union as, um, for some, Okay, this is celebration within the home. Um, I see, um, yeah, this can be you all, um, like I said, for those of you that are going to be moving, you can be, um, you know, trying to furnish your home as well. You're spending, you know, um, spending on new items, you know, to decorate, you know, and all of that good stuff, okay. You have the Six of Swords. The Five of Wands. Yeah, this was the uh, unexpected change here within this connection. Okay. Yeah, someone, uh, you possibly could have been feeling stuck, okay? But you got um, justice in the situation by um, leaving it behind, okay? You escaped tr trouble here. This is possibly um, a tower that you avoided, you know, by leaving this connection, you know, getting out of that energy of feeling stuck because you were indecisive with the Three of Pentacles here, okay? But um, I see that you're still, you know, trying to work on improving the situation but with the queen of pentacles here it's like um now you're not giving you know any more of your time energy or resources in this connection okay why is financial and material changes here Okay, you have the Ten of Cups that came out. This is um, somebody not wanting something to end. Okay, but then you have the Ten of Wands. Yeah, someone definitely felt like um, you just gave up too soon in this connection with the Ten of Cups in a reverse and the Ten of Wands. All right, this was unexpected. Someone possibly 
what I'm getting here is someone could have um, just up and left a connection, you know, um, just got in their car and left kind of thing, and just, you know, they're, they're traveling, they're traveling um, long distance, all right? Okay. Yeah, with the Nine of Wands, it's letting me know that you gave up on this um, connection here because you have the Ten of Spades. Um, you lost up hope. You've been through, you know, too much already. You've been through enough. All right. It's like you're saying, you know, no more of this here. I'm going towards my happiness. Okay. You could have felt like. Um, you know, this person betrayed you, stabbed you in the back. Yeah, with the Queen of Wands, or Queen of Swords here. Um, okay, and you have the Six of Cups, alright? This is having, you know, a happy outcome or good, you know, good results as well. You have the Seven of Cups and the Death card, okay? The Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, someone was, um, you know, having doubts in this connection, okay? Someone was unfaithful as well. Okay? Someone could have, um reached out to someone else here in the past um, but you're telling me that um, someone you know you could have this person blocked okay all right with the eight of Pentacles here this is good news positive events okay you could have um, unexpected money coming in to you during this time um, you also have the Three Cups. This is you, uh, rejoicing and celebration, being around those that you love during this time, okay? The Four of Swords here. Um, this is you, um, taking a pause, uh, to regroup and meditate, alright? Movement choices and decisions. Yeah, with the Seven of Pentacles, um, someone was, you know, discouraged, alright? Someone could have, um, you know, just been feeling like they were worried that this wasn't going to work out and this was, um, you know, this actually happened, you know, that's, that came true for them. That, that's what was hidden with the Nine of Pentacles and the Nine of Swords here, okay? Um, someone was causing confusion, all right? This could have been, like I said, unforeseen. Um, this unexpected change, someone had got up and left, you know. Um, yeah, you have the Two of Pentacles here at the bottom of the deck. Um, someone lost control of a situation here, okay? Someone could have felt like it was just too much, all right? Too much was done. You've been through enough as well, okay? The situation wasn't getting any, any better for you, all right? So you took your chances on leaving, all right? Okay, Capricorn. Um, I'm going to pull out Angel's Answers for you to close out your reading. I definitely see you getting away from a situation here. Any other messages for my Capricorn? You're ready. You 
have Astro Angels. Not the right time. <clears throat> and meditation brings answers. Okay? I feel like, um... You're ready, okay? This is going to be a new time for you to, to step out there to do something new, okay? Um, don't be discouraged, all right? You have what it takes as well. It is safe for you to love, you know, trust that um, this new person that's coming in, like I said, it's going to be balanced for you. Ask your angels if there's anything that you feel like you're lacking or in need of during this time. Go within. Um... Meditate, ask your angels, um, whatever is necessary. I feel like you will find the answers um, that you've been, you know, seeking during this time. All right, not the right time for, I feel like, you dealing with this person. Um, some of you possibly could be wanting to go travel and see some, see someone at a distance. And maybe your finances isn't looking... Um, you know, the best right now, okay, give it a little time, um, I don't see this being a good month for you, um, to do so, all right, meditation brings answers again, um, if you're wondering which path to take, I feel like, um, you know, listen to your intuition during this time, okay, pay attention to the signs, all right, you have within a few when within the next few months okay i feel like this is regarding you um again if it's travel or some of you are waiting to make a move as well okay um others of you have choices and decisions that you're making this month and you are traveling as well okay but i feel like within the next few months here things will look better um for you yeah and um <clears throat> all right it'll be up to you here as far as um you know this um new journey that you may be taking okay but just trust in yourself and your intuition and in your spirit guys that um everything that they are leading you to is being done for your your highest good here all right, Capricorn, so I'm going to leave it there. I hope this helps. Thanks for watching. Bye.